It's funny how the magic of life plays itself out. So many things in my life have been because of a second chance. I was really proud of my first performance on Champions. Leaving the competition is John Dornball. Playing in the NFL, I was taught that when you lose, you figure it out. What could I have done differently that would have got me that extra vote that maybe would have sent me through? And then all of a sudden, I got the call, and I'm the wild card. He's been through so much in his life, from losing his parents at such a young age to losing his dream of being a professional football player because he almost died of a heart aneurysm. John is such a fighter. It makes me so proud to be his wife and to stand next to him. I've been a wild card my whole life. I believe that everything happens for a reason, and I believe that there's magic everywhere. And now to have a second chance here, I know that I'm in the right spot and that I'm doing what I'm meant to be doing. I'm here to win it. Yeah, baby! Thank you! Man! What's going on, baby? Oh, man! It is good to be here. I'm the wild card, baby. It's time to have some fun. Let me tell you. All right, here's the deal. I got four chalkboards. They're numbered one, two, three, and four. Now, Simon, Heidi, Mel, Howie, you guys are going to choose which chalkboard is going to represent you guys. So, hey, you don't know what's behind there. I've drawn something, and I've written some stuff on each one. We're going to get to it in a little bit. So, Simon, well, you want to see number one. Okay, number one it is. <laughs> Simon, number one. Heidi, guess what? Same thing. Do you want two, three, I, or four? Yeah, I would like to be the number two, then. Number two it is. <laughs> you guys are making this easy on me. Mel B, three or four? I will go for the number three. Threes it is. Mel B. Oh, I know what I want to be. Howie, my man, number four. Now, you guys had a free choice. This is what I love about this show. This show changed my life. Howie, you've toured the country, man. You've toured the world. You've sold out venues all over the place. Right. And I want to be just like you. So I actually got cities off of your tour schedule. So here's a bunch of cities and states of places that you've performed that I want to perform one day. OK. So we're going to pick one right now. When I riffle, say stop. Are you ready? Yes. Say stop. Stop riffling. You want to keep going or do you want that? No, I want to stop. Are you sure? I really need to stop. Okay, hey. Here you go. Don't look at it. Okay. Slide it out. Keep okay. it right there. All right. I started AGT doing a card trick. So Mel B, we're going to do just that. I'm going to do a card trick. I'm going to make okay. it really simple on you. All you're going to do is as I riffle through here, all you got to do is say stop. Are you ready? So just say stop. Stop. Right here. Watch carefully. I'm going to rip a corner. Queen of Hearts. Hold on the Queen, Mel. Heidi, let me see your hand. It's when you take the corner that that corner disappears, just like that, gone. Now, there's a stack of pictures that have been sitting right here. I haven't touched them. I haven't come close to them. Nope. Why don't we pick up all those pictures and see if there's something underneath right there? Pick up everything? Pick them all up. You're going to find one thing. Oh. There's a corner to a card right there. Now, hold on, Mel B. Take that corner. Make sure it fits perfect right there. I, I don't want to touch it. it. Get it, get She's it. She's got nails. Howie to the rescue. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Make sure it fits perfect yes, right there. And does. that is, in fact, the corner. Now, Heidi. I love this. Heidi, your whole career, you've done outrageous. What is this? <laughs> what is that? Well, I'm a witch, obviously. And Halloween, you go over the top. But these are pictures of you, whether it's Halloween, whether it's red carpets. It's just all the cool events that you've been able to go to. Yeah. And guess what? You're going to do the same thing Howie did. All you're going to do, as I riffle, is just say stop. Just light my head in it? If Whatever you want. All righty. I'm riffle ready when it. you are. Whoop, okay, don't look at it. Not Slide looking. it over just like this. Simon, I got a deck of cards here. All you gotta do is just touch one. Just touch it. Now look, hold on. I'm gonna give you the opportunity. Do you wanna keep this one or do you wanna change your mind? I'll keep it. Are you sure? Yeah. Remember this moment. I'm giving you a chance to change your mind. No, I'm gonna keep it. Here it is. Thank Take you. it and look at it if you want. Howie, what did you pick? What this Turn is? it over. Can Show I... everybody what it is. You and I are going somewhere, buddy. And exactly. where is it? Tulsa, Oklahoma. There it is. Let, let me see it. Tulsa, Oklahoma. The judges had a free choice of whatever chalkboard they wanted. Hey, Terry, can you do me a favor? There's a, a chalkboard with uh, Howie's face on there. Why don't you go ahead and turn that chalkboard around for me, man? Because I drew something on that no, chalkboard. How you and I are going to Tulsa, Oklahoma. Now, <laughs> you could have selected any card you wanted to. 
You chose the Queen of Hearts. Terry, spin that thing around for me. I had a premonition that not only would she choose that chalkboard, but you were gonna pick a Queen of Hearts. That's crazy. Heidi. How is that even yes. possible? You've done a lot of cool things in your career. What did you do today with that picture? I was a schmetterling for what is Halloween. That? I was what? a butterfly for that's Halloween. A, that's a butterfly? Yeah. That's amazing. You chose number two. Terry, do me a favor. Turn over number two. I made a prediction and drew a picture before the show that you were going to be a butterfly. Now, hold on. We got one left. We got one left. Simon, I told you there was a defining moment when you could have changed your mind and you said, no. Yeah. You picked a card. I did. What do you got? I three of clubs. Three you clubs. had the first choice. You could have chosen any chalkboard you wanted, one, two, three, or four. My man went with number one. I wrote a card down on the back of that chalkboard. Terry, let me see it, my man. All right. Turn that around. That there's the three of clubs. Oh, thank you. Thank you. But hold on. Howie, in the quarterfinals of America's Got Talent, I had a huge map on that stage. Roll that clip. No. Just like that, Howie, in season 11, you chose Oklahoma, That's Oklahoma. just like you did today. How's that possible? Mel B, you chose any card you wanted to, and you chose a heart. Hearts follow you everywhere you go, because in the first round of America's Got Talent, the champions, I asked the audience to write words of what described the champion. You could have chosen any word you wanted to. You selected whatever word you wanted, and lo and behold, the word you chose, heart. Predicted back then, and there's your heart. Now, Heidi. I believe it was the semifinal, season 11. I sat up here and I had all you guys think of whatever you wanted and you could draw whatever you want. And in season 11, I made a prediction that today, you'd go back to that Halloween party as a butterfly. Right there, you drew a butterfly. Whoa! Now hold on. The moment it comes down to, I wanted to end my journey the same way I started. Because in season 11, when he just thought of any card he wanted to, my man Simon picked a three of clubs right there just like he picked no. today. And I ended the same way I started with Simon Cowell holding awesome. the three of clubs. My name's John Dornbach, baby. It's a great day to be alive. Peace out. I love every single one of you. Thank you guys, my man. John Dornbach. Come up here, man. Wow! Heidi, yes. your thoughts? I mean, you are multi-talented. You really, really are. I mean, you speak from the heart and you boost our spirit every time when you come onto the stage. You're so entertaining, you're so good. Simon. You've come back and just blown the roof off with what I've just seen. Yes. I mean, genuinely, I'm not just saying that, John. We're not voting, the 50 states are voting. You have a shot. Thank you. I and mean, that was amazing. Thank you. I mean, purely fantastic. Yeah, awesome, man. Howie, your thoughts? Oh, my gosh. I'm, 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 like, just stunned. I really am. There are only two words to describe what you did tonight, and that is wild card. My gosh. You are a champion. Thank you, baby. Now, John, being a wild card tonight, how do you feel about coming back? Let me tell you, I'm going to share something with you guys for the first time, because my wife and I haven't told anybody. And before this show, a few days ago, magic happened. We got a bun in the oven, and this guy right here is about to be a dad. Yeah. And my wife's out there, baby. I love you. And a little dorm boss is going to be putting around here, so take cover. <laughs> well, good luck tonight, John. Thank you. Please give it up for John Dornball. Hi, YouTube. Click below to subscribe for more talent.